Darren, we've absolutely dominated proceedings from start to finish, really, and it's an absolute sucker punch at the end to not come away, come away with anything. Just gives you your initial thoughts. Yeah. Just again, I'm you know I'm, I'm boring myself. I know I get criticised for it, but it's both boxes, isn't it? You know, opportunities to have the game well and truly out of sight. Even their manager sort of said at the end, game should have been over at half time. But we haven't got enough quality in front of goal at the minute, you know. And even going one nil up, you still the opposition has still got an opportunity to get back in the game. They only need that one chance. We. We take a set piece that's just not good enough. It's a crap ball in from Medi that it's the first man. Should be playing short to Dave to Tonda and just keeping the ball. Um, and then we sort of recycle it, put it back in, and they hit us on the counter. Uh, and then the throw in, you know, when not marked up. It's just it's just basic stuff. You know, but again, it's it's both boxes, and they've had one or two chances, and they've taken two. We've had several chances and only taken one. It's it's a it's the same old scenario, but what frustrates me is the amount of work we do on it. So, you know, we don't leave any stone unturned. Me and Junior, we're, we're big on finer detail and that. It would obviously suggest otherwise because we keep getting undone by it, but it tells me I've got personnel that maybe need changing and, and ain't good enough to do what we're looking for him to do because, you know, basic areas are costing us at the minute. There must be that frustration because... We've seen over the course of the season what the players' capabilities are and what they can do. It, there must be that frustration knowing that we could have had the game to bed by half time today. Yeah, I'm bitterly, I'm, I'm really frustrated, really frustrated because game should have, game sh- we should have won the game, in, in my opinion. Um, but, you know, we haven't defended a, a set piece well enough, we haven't had people brave enough to get the first touch on it. Don't matter about size, don't matter about. You know, physicality is about being brave enough to protect your goal. You know, I'd have been standing here cheesed off with a point, to be honest, but to come away with nothing. So I'm, I'm just, I'm really frustrated and yeah. bitterly disappointed, but there's, there's, there's got to be some change at this club over the next few months, maybe, you know, next summer and that. Obviously, people would suggest that it might need to be me that needs to be changed, but while I'm here, I'll continue trying to do the best I can for the club. Um, but change certainly needs to happen because we need we need people that are a little bit more passionate about playing for this club. Um, and passion can be played out in many ways. Um, and I need to start seeing a bit of passion when the opposition's got a set piece or a corner at the minute and I ain't seeing enough of it trying to take positive from tonight Efron Mason Clark he's back on the score sheet and he put in a pretty solid performance out there that can only boost his confidence yeah I thought he played well he was a, he was a bit of a threat the entire game and there's a great goal to, to finish um, that, that gave us the lead just once in a while he's got to you know, work on his end product but it's something we're constantly working on but you know I, don't, I, th- I thought our play was good we looked solid and we, we played some good stuff today on the counter attack, we looked a real threat going forward, and you know I'm just I'm just gutted that I stand here having watched that game and find ourselves on on the wrong side of the result.